Hi guys, so we're doing a colorful eyeshadow look today. If you guys want to see how I achieved this look, continue to watch. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what you guys think. Okay, so I already did my brows off camera. I'm using the James Charles Morphe palette, and I'm starting off with that blue shade. And I'm making sure I'm buffing my concealer in. And I'm using a flat eyeshadow brush just to kind of press that shadow in. I'm only pressing. I'm not swiping. I'm not swirling. I just want that shadow to just lay there. Okay, so now I'm using that purple shade. And this is a Morphe 307 brush, I believe. And now I'm swirling that purple on top of that blue. So the blue is going to be my foundation. And that purple is just going to give me that ombre smoked out look. All right, so now I'm gonna use that pink shade and I'm gonna lightly tap that pink on top of that purple. And if you notice, I went from darkest to light just to give me a better ombre effect. All right, so now I'm gonna cut my crease and I'm using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Parcelain. And this is a Ruby Kisses concealer brush that I use as well. If you don't know how to cut your crease, you can always look up like I did just now. And it will kind of give you a map of where you should cut your crease. You don't want to go too low, but then you don't want to go too high. So you just have to practice and play with it, y'all. And I must say, cut creases aren't as easy as everything else is. With the cut crease, you really have to have precision. And if you notice, I'm looking downward because I get to see more of my eye detail. I like to look in a small mirror so I can make sure I got my cut crease really crisp and sharp. Alright, so now I'm going in with that orange shade, and I'm going to use a Real Techniques brush. I'm not sure what type of brush it is, but it's really, really small. So when you're dealing with shadows, you want to make sure you have detailed brushes. You don't want to use a big fluffy brush when you're trying to apply eyeshadow to your lid. It just won't give you the same effect. And nothing has changed. It's pat, 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 tap, 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 swiper. No swiping. All right, so now I'm taking that green shade and we're still pressing and patting. So now for that blue shade, we're doing the same thing, pressing and patting. You don't wanna swipe and dust away those colors. We wanna press so those colors can stick and stay. So we got the hard part out the way now. I'm using a LA Colors Black Liquid Liner just to line my eyes. I'm not doing a wing. I just want to do like a tight line.
And we gon' buff it in. We gon' blend it in. And now I'm using my foundation. And we're blending that as well. 